Hi, I'm Mac. Here's how to beat Glassway on Grandmaster difficulty. First, let's talk about loadouts. Everyone should have a kinetic scout rifle with explosive rounds. The one you get from the New Light quest is perfectly fine. One person needs a solar anti-barrier weapon. The other two can run any other anti-barrier weapon. I like Stars and Shadow for solar, and I glow SMG otherwise. Everyone should run Anarchy. If you run on Solar Stasis, run Spoils of War for heavy on champion finishers. Otherwise, run Thermal Overload for overload stuns on grenades. Everyone should run Surge Eater for grenade recharge on stuns. Use Overload Scout and Anti Barrier for the gun you chose, either Pulse or SMG. Also, use Global Reach if you have a Warmind Cell weapon. Optional mods that help with survivability are Charge Harvester, Stacks on Stacks, and Protective Light. All classes should run Stasis with Duskfield Grenades to stun and freeze Overload Champions. You can also use Ursa Furiosa on Titan for safer reses, or Top Tree Voidwalker with Controverse Hold for better burst damage. Alright, let's go! First thing you're going to want to do is pull out your Sparrow and go forward until you find the first set of adds. Team shoot the adds from far away with your Scout Rifle. Use scout rifles and grenades to stun and kill overload champions. Make sure you're careful of snipers, they hurt. Jump into the first room to spawn adds and then run back out. You can stick anarchy down on the top of the ledge to deal with wretches. Kill the overload. Next, kill the anti-barrier champion. You can finish it for heavy if you have spoils of war. Alright, next room. Anarchy the boss. Go ahead and shoot the miscellaneous adds. Kill the Overload. Kill the Barrier. And then you're off to the next room. Jump down and then come back up to spawn the adds. Make sure you shoot from very far away and careful of the boss. He's a sniper. Kill the rest of the adds and the champions. Kill the boss. And next room. Kill all the adds. Kill the champions. Kill more champions. Careful of the snipers, they hurt. And next room. Have one person on the plate, spawn adds, and then get off of the plate. And then kill the adds. And be careful, there's a heavy shank. Get back on the plate to spawn the adds on the right side. Kill all the adds. Especially the heavy shank. And then back on the plate. Spawn the adds on the left side. Careful, there's two snipers up there. Kill all the adds, and then get back on the plate. Spawn the adds on the right side, careful there's two snipers, and then get back on the plate. All three players can be on the plate and stay on until it's at 100%. Different players should focus different sides of the adds. Prioritize the explosive shanks. Kill the rest of the adds. Be careful of snipers. And then onto the boss room. This is left side where, where you'll spend most of your time. This is the spawn entrance. This is the mid entrance. And this is the back entrance. Kill the champion to start, finish for heavy. Aggro the overloads through middle, careful of the small boss. Kill the overloads, there's two of them. Damage the small boss until it goes to two thirds HP, so it goes away. This will make two more overloads spawn. Bait the overloads through middle and kill them. Damage the boss until the boss despawns. It'll happen at two-thirds HP. Stack up on back left side. Throw your grenade and anarchies to kill the first wyvern. And then kill the second wyvern. This is a good time to use supers, uh, just to be safe in case someone dies. Kill the boss until it's one-third HP so it goes away. This will spawn two more wyverns. Bait the wyverns through middle to kill them easily. Dustfield grenades are really nice here to freeze and kill the four barrier hobgoblins outside. You can finish them for heavy. The boss will spawn back along with two more overload minotaurs. Bait the overload minotaurs through middle. Be careful of fanatics. Damage the boss a little bit to spawn two more overload minotaurs. Bait them through middle and kill. Damage the boss until he hits one third. He will despawn and come back immediately with two wyverns and the small boss. Kill the left wyvern immediately as it comes out of the portal. Go back into left room and kill the second wyvern. Kill the small boss. 
Stay far away from it after killing so that the death explosion doesn't kill you. This will spawn two more wyverns. Bait the wyverns through mid and kill them. Careful of going outside. There's four barrier hobgoblins up. You can ignore them and just anarchy the boss until it dies. Good job. You beat Glassman and Grandmaster. Make sure you hit subscribe.